Let's fuck this lady up. Now it's just you and me. Let's go. You want to fight, lady? We'll give you a fight. We're all here now. <laughs> We're all here now. You wanted a fight, lady. We'll give you a fight. Sup, lady. Have some plague. Did she teleport herself? No, she teleported me over there and she set it on fire, isn't she? No, she's giving herself hard to steal to give her more defense. Well, you see. You see. Let's go up here. Let's go up here with Beast. Might as well. Might as well. Oh, I forgot he died. I have to redo this. The rain gun. There we go. E that was significantly easier. Hey, yeah, lady, you're going to miss your turn. Why? Because it's fair. It's fair in my opinion. You're going to miss your turn and uh, we're just going to get some backstabs on you. And we're, we're just going to get at you, you know? It happens. It happens. Can we hit her from here? No, too far away. Let's just start working our way back. We're very slow. I didn't move there. I moved down there. That was a waste of two AP. Oh, hey, lady, you're free. There you go. Have some arrows. Oh, you want a, you want a fireball? Oh, that's actually a bad idea. Uh, you want um. Yeah, let's just shoot you. Oh, hey, lady, look, it's Fane. Remember the guy you teleported to you and then you tried to fuck over? Yeah, now, now he's gonna go kick your ass. Yeah, we'll just leave him out of it. This is a fight between these guys. Yeah, we're gonna fuck her up. We're gonna fuck her up. Oh no, hail strike. Oh, thank God for the poison though. Thank you very much. Here, have some arrows. Here, have some more arrows. Oh no, poison. Yeah, fuck this lady. This one specifically. Well, well, oh, quite the mess made here. I'm Malady, and you. A Malady. She steps forward, grabs you behind the neck with alarming strength, and pulls you close. She sniffs twice, her nose at your ear, then bites, piercing the lobe with a needle sharp fang. She releases you and grins, running tongue over teeth. God woken. What's up with elves liking to lick and bite people? I know they can like read people that way. Still, that's some kinky shit. Uh, rub your ear, milady. Was it? Is th she sick or something? My mother certainly thought so. <laughs> I didn't hurt you, did I? Nah. She leans back, looks you over, and smirks. So, God woken, you're what gets some of us out of bed each morning. Oh. What do you make? I don't of know that? why I keep. Okay. I don't, I don't understand why it keeps trying to, to sense it keeps trying to censor the word waifu it's the first time it was all lowercase so I had to allow that and now because of the all uppercase I have to allow that milady equals ultimate waifu seen and heard plenty of strange things lately you want to uh, is to see the picture behind the puzzle true well first things first she peers at you closely a knowing squint in her eye tell me which of those little gods did you meet? <laughs> and what did they teach you? Hmm. 
She's asking for privileged information. That it is. And if you want to take my boat off this island, you oh. consider me a privileged party. So she's in charge of the Lady Vengeance. I understand. Believe it or not, I'm here to help you. So? Okay, I'll tell you, my but lady. Let's go wide. <clears throat> go on, then. Show me what she taught you. Ask why she looks so surprised. I don't. Now go on. A quick second. Go and, uh... Claw on our couch. She looked at me as if she did something wrong right when I walked out there. So she knows she did something wrong. Uh, yes, cast it on Milady. Milady, here you go. Hey, that stings. She examines her hands, where the skin sizzles slightly beneath their newfound aura. As the spell fades, the skin heals once more. Her whole body seems to relax. Interesting, isn't it? You really are Godwoken. Hell yeah, my lady. I'm happy. Oh, how unbecoming. <laughs> Come then, we set sail. Your destiny awaits, etc. Yeah, what does she mean by destiny? You'll have to ask the Meister about that. She's dying to meet you. Melody beckons you to the boat. After you, darling. Uh... If you choose to read, you will not be able to return again. Your open quest will be closed and archived. No, no, I want her to wait. We're not done As here yet. You wish. We're not done yet. We gotta loot. <laughs> Look at all these things. So many things and stuffs. Where's the corpse of that one guy? He's right there. I can see him, but I don't think I can click on him because the big guy's in the way. Oh, wait, I stopped for a second. I stopped for a second. There is a way to click on him. Oh, that's not what I want. Oh, there we go. Perfect. I did the thing. I did the the, the left alt. <laughs> All these corpses really quick. Yeah, so we have some, some unfinished business right before we leave. We will be leaving by the end of the stream, 100%. Easy. So what other things do we have? Recover the remaining pieces of captain's armor. Join my lady, okay. Escape Reaper's eye. Fate worse than death. This is what happens to the soul jars. There, who, what? Who are you people? Who are you people? You look magical. Before I approach you, I'm gonna save just in case. Why aren't these guys following? Get down here. You too. Get down here. Is it, were they? Tra I think they were trapped because of the poison. Okay, so we're gonna save really quick. Who are you, people? I can't talk to either of you. They just exist. Ooh, stuff. Okay. Let's look at all our stuff really quick. We got a, a summoning tome. Which we already have. 
We have... Well, we might as well use it. Since we're getting 71 anyways, we'll save it. We have a sky shot. Ooh, we didn't buy sky shot, so I'm glad we didn't. We got intelligence robes. Oh, that's pretty good. We got... Two-handed mace, two-handed axe, book. A belt that needs to be identified. We have a shield that needs to be identified. Gloves to be identified. Let's see, let's start from the top again. Let's see, we get a really good belt. Really nice belt. I think it might go beast. I'm gonna go to beast. Got a good shield. Mm-hmm. We got finesse gloves. Oh, that's hundred percent going to Sabil. Okay, we got an intelligence chess pieces that we just used. Retribution for our necklace. That's pretty good. Give it to Sibyl. We get intelligence boots. Pretty good. And then. We're just gonna really quickly go make these non slip again. Up. For my nails. Just so we don't forget. There we go. Okay. Another book. Okay, let's go drop this in Sibyl's area. It's here. So that's where we have to go for that quest. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so this is Escape the Island. Escape the Island, Escape the Island. Decide the fate of the soul jars. It's a hailless people. So, I'm assuming Sahelis people is on a different, like, later in the game. This is just join the lady to escape the island. These it says not fully to do yet. Because these are higher level than what we are. This is like, oh, don't do these to like your level 15 kind of thing. And the pirate chest. I'll have to look that one up. So what we're going to do really quick. Rat. I love so rat. Those things down the steps there are dangerous. The ones hanging on the sticks. Want to go to the wharf, don't I? I'm a wharf rat. There's food and stuff on the wharf. Might even be a ship. I've always wanted to be a ship rat. Okay, right. Great. I'll go, sir. Cheers. Bye, rat. <laughs> the rat's now going. Okay. So, got buns. I have an honest question. Are we able to return back to Fort Joy after we leave? Because it said we wouldn't. Are we able to come back? Not at all? Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Hey there, old buddy, old acquaintance. Want to team up again? Sure. Whatever's anyway. See you. Okay, so. If that's the case, and we're never going to be able to return. I'm going to take those, like, named items that we had. I'm just going to sell them. The, shrine depicts the ones that we the were saving. Take since they don't transfer over from those chest to chest, and we can never return. I'm just going to go and sell them. 
Not the ones from the mods, but like these ones. The ones that we actually earned. My MD can't do anything with. Uh, this one. This one, this one, this one, this one. I think that's oh, this one. And that one. Okay, the rest of them oh, will stay in here because those were mod stuff. How much is it overweighing me by? A good amount. Okay. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Let's teleport back, sell this stuff if we can. The stone, the statue. Th I'm here, you. She looks at you with wet. Good to see you. You take care now. And don't you let me down. Okay, well. Sell, sell, sell it all. What you got? Yes. Enough for that. Give me a money. Taking all my money back now by selling these things. Give me my money back. I guess the only other thing we can really... Dang it. We're over encumbered again. How about how much? By one. Okay, well, what can we give away that weighs one? Have, uh. It is Jar of Magus. There you go. Uh, oh, wait. I know who we can sell it to. I know who we can sell it to. And we can get stuff out of it, too. Wait, let's talk to Butters before we leave. Butter! Butter! Move along! Alright, wrong person. There you go. Butter! She smiles and sing! Uh, okay, never mind. Bye, Butter. The shrine depicts the hum. Okay, uh, back to the beach. So to this person. Hello! Sell to you. Bop, bop, bop. We'll do one at a time. Bop. Cool. Bop, 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 bop. Bop, 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 bop. Well, I don't know why I'm saving this stuff. This stuff can be sold too. There we go, 3,000 worth. Okay. There's random things in here. That you just sell. I think we're fine. Oh wait, no, we can sell this. I think that's it, okay. No, wait, no, we're gonna keep it because we're gonna do, put it on our Plague Boy. So we got this. And then we're gonna take all of her gold. What else equals out? That we want. We got some Valkyrie stuff. We have some trickster stuff. We have priest. And summoning. Blacksmith. I think what we want to go for is we're going to go with... We're going to go with Siren. We're going to go with... Regurgitate, what is that? Vomit up cursed blood in a cone, thereby removing severe negative effects from yourself, but does damage, and does 22 to 23 physical armor damage. 
to characters in its path. Interesting. Bat Swarm. Blood Rush. Bloodthirsty. Jump to an enemy, hitting them all at once. Your might was water damage. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's see, War Cry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Is that Ragnar Lothbrook from uh, Vikings? Yeah, that's another spin move that we already have, but we don't use. There's Odin from the MCU. As that image. Oh, there's Helia from the MCU. Very fun. Uh, I want so something for. I wish there. I wish I had more pyrotechnic and huntsman stuff, honestly, because there's. I don't feel like there's enough for beast. I don't feel like there's enough for beast in with, with the like the added mods I have. We're gonna go with this one. I don't think she has anything else that's worth like 90. Probably should buy something that's worth 90. No, we'll just, hmm. Take these back. Wait, what can we take back that's worth around 90? If anything, we take this. No, wait, yes, we could. I'm gonna just give her something else in return. Have uh Oh, have a train. The Stone King, the statue was... Okay, train gone. I think the last thing we're gonna do before we leave is we're gonna look for the pirate treasure. Because there is pirate treasure somewhere. There is pirate treasure somewhere and it needs to be found. Here. Threads of the curse. Threads of a curse. Okay. We're looking around. I think there's something here. Ah. So we're gonna go teleport to there. Get all the pirate treasure really quick and then we will leave. 
Let's go this way. Ooh, chests and stuff. Can't reach. Oh, oh. Oh. I see. So that's where that goes. We never she never looked into that at all. We just kind of expected nothing to be there. Oh no. Oh. Attack this. Doesn't do anything. We don't have any of the skulls, yeah, no. We need to teleport in. Well, here we go. I'm surprised we made it across. Okay. Let's go with the, where are the teleportation gloves? There they are. You first, let's go. Bop. We'll teleport them all in, and we'll do all this stuff. And I'm not gonna teleport Sir Laura this time because I know he can teleport himself. Ow, it reflected. Okay. And somewhere. In vain. And then the re clip re equip my gloves. In vain, you can do that. Teleport me. And then he re equips he, he re-equips his gloves. And beast, you no, me teleport. I teleport. Teleport you. Here. So Bill, you're gonna walk over here, so you're out of the way. The very roundabout way of doing this. Teleport. Bada boop beep. And then on equip and re-equip. Then do it again. Super simple, easy like. There's a dead guy. Wait, wait. There's a dead guy there? Jimfred. Wait, what? Okay, Jimfred. Thank you very much. Another skull crumbled to bits. Okay. Didn't have to do that at all. Hello, Jimfred. Okay. And down we go. This is a way we've not bought we've not been. Ooh, stuff. I like stuff.
This way. Wait, people? Why can't I speak to you people? It's a thing. Save this. Just in case, you never know what could happen. A purple barrier hums as you approach, sealing a chest inside a mm. circle of ancient stones. The symbols will curse anyone that dares near. This chest cannot open unless the magic is dispelled. We bless it. We're gonna absorb another jar. Sorry, person. We're gonna save the captain, though. But we're gonna absorb these the necromancers. Before you, cold, and as you remove the lid for a moment, you. Sorry, necromancers. The lid flies open uh, with a metallic oh, screen. Captain! A one-armed skeleton clad in a pristine coat unfolds himself from inside the chest. He rolls his neck, aligning spine and skull in a long, crackling chorus. <clears throat> Speak. Ask who he is. Captain Sek Zappa, slaver of the seas, servant of the Source King. Thank you for your help, do I? Now, I'll thank you for your life. Oh, no. Uh, we have better stats in intelligence, wits. We have better intelligence. Ah. Uh. Bracus Rex will get his due. Rise, ye dogs. Take this fish. Your death is beneath. No. Rise and be Sir. I'm gonna read. I'm gonna redo that. I'm gonna reload that. I'm gonna reload that once. I'm reload that once. See if we don't get him to fuck us up. You know, maybe, maybe. Let's try this again. I can take your soul. I can take your soul jar. Yeah, we only have one persuasion. Who has the highest persuasion? It's me? Oh no. Um, we need three persuasion. Do we have any gear that gives us persuasion? I stack it on me. Any gear at all? Um, uh, let's see. He has zero persuasion. He has zero persuasion. He has one. Right, no, we don't got shit. Um. Mm. This is not good. Captain, I'm sorry. Fuck it. The soul jar pulses. Shatter the jar. Life. What remains of the outraged soul molds itself into a defiant skull, glaring at you before it vanishes. Sorry, Captain. Worm. Sorry, Captain. The jar stands before you as you remove the Now what happens if we bless it still? Be blessed. He's a corpse. Aha! I beat him. Is that it? No, it's a recovered yeah, the remaining set still. We found his very fine coat on his corpse after we uh, smashed his soul jar. Take that, Captain. Okay, I'm actually gonna go to the bathroom really quick. I'll be right back. Okay. So, did that over here? Try to talk to these people. Who are you? I see a trap, nearby. trap. Perfect. Who are you people? I must say, I was hoping to enjoy a sm lacking skin may make me a target for mortals but I am mercifully immune to mosquitoes. However, they are infuriating when they get in one skull. I can barely hear myself think. We'll talk later. This is the way you go. Ah, stuff. Stuff and things. Ah, 
Absolutely nothing is up here. Okay. Forgot that. There's apparently one last piece that we are missing for this uh, stuff. We're missing his hat. If we can find his hat, we're good. It sucks we don't have another thing to open these. Make it like a nice clean path through so we still have to teleport. Sadly. Okay. Really quick about. Cool. Nothing. Jill. That's okay. Yeah, one of three. So we have two pieces. We have this and we have the wherever the other pieces. Right there, the boots. Another supercharger, which we don't need. Uh, what is this? Intelligence leggings? It's actually better. We'll take them. We'll take them. Screw it. Okay. Find these teleportation gloves. Teleport everyone over. Again. You. There. And then start heading down to the beach. Go like right here. You. Bop. And bop. What do you mean you can't reach, my dude? Where are you? Is that... Are you kidding me? You can't reach because the door was closed. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Just go down there. And then... You need to stay here because you need to help me teleport. We're going to switch that. And then Sibyl is going to put these on and teleport me. Bop. Bop. And we're going to switch those back out. Perfect. We're going to run them down to the beach now. Down to the beach. Perfecto. You guys get back in here too. Get back in this party. Cave somewhere. North of Dragon's Beach. This way. Here, maybe it's not this cave. Let me look at the map. From what I can tell. There. The opposite direction from where we're headed. Onward, this way. 
over here. Ha ha! Cave. Ooh, two knockdown arrows. That's so good. That's so good. Into the cave. The captain's hideaway. Give me that chest. This chest is chastity in it. Give me this chest. Another knockdown arrow, dude. Let's go. Open this door. Is locked. The ancient woman ah. to salt and seed. Not a single nick or gouge mars the detailed face carved across its surface. It's such a cool door. It also has no lock or handle. But when you run your fingers across the wood, the carved face comes to life. This ship has the claim of a captain. Unless you belong to Sex Zapper, I suggest you leave. The captain's dead. Yeah, right. Cap doesn't die. He waits. Ask the door to open. Well, since you are oh, so shit. like No. We don't have any of these. <laughs> no. Bro, I will fight you. Didn't you hear me on the first? Yeah, right. I be the guardian of me captain's flagship. I'm mm. what stands between dross like ye mm. and his life's work. Get out my sight, you bilge-drenched vermin. I'll fight you. The ancient wooden it also this ship has the claim of a captain. Well, since you are Yeah, no, we we need because we can't attack it either. He's burning, but he's not doing anything. Cause we need to get in there. We need to get in here. Can we teleport past? You think we can teleport past? No, I don't think so. We need more persuasion. Less. Unless. Unless, unless we can teleport around and go through this hole right here. Didn't you hear me on the first? I be the gun. Get out, miss. But he is dead. The ancient would be this ship as the claim of a captain. Yeah, right. Cap doesn't. Well. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I want to finish it. I'm motivated. I want. I want to finish it. We're gonna finish it. Damn it. Gosh darn it. We're going to the square. Okay. Down we go. That is. Um, no, we're, we're fine with us. It's Beast, because Beast's the only one who hasn't talked to him yet. Bop, 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 bop. Talk to him, Beast. You're our only hope. You're our only hope, beast. Convince the door to open. 
Using a strong boy finesse. The shrine again. Okay, we're running back. Run it back. I want I want to leave the island before we end stream. I don't even have my Mangekyo Sharingan equipped. I just realized that. Mangekyo Sharingan. This boy. This boy over here, he's trying to get into my closet. Yeah, that's right. You heard. You heard me. I was going to toss the stuffed animal at your butt. Okay. Beast. Go convince this door to open. The ancient wooden door. It also has no. This ship has the claim of the captain. Unless you belong. The door falls silent. Wait. All, the, all we had to do was be beast? Yeah. I've had enough of your yowling. Get along then. Wait, we didn't even have to be be first to all I had to do was talk to him as beast. <laughs> okay. I didn't even need to be persuasive. I just need to be a beast. Copper ring. A hat. A gold cup. Okay. Oh, hello. Hello. Okay. They have all the parts of the of the of the thing now. Beast, you can be a pirate. Look at your beast. Super pirate like. Oh, let's go. Oh my goodness. You he, enemies who move in your aura will be charmed. Let's go, beast. The pimp himself. Okay. I think that's all we can really do. Because I don't know where Sahela's people are. I don't think. Like, we can... Let's just... Let's just go. We have one more jo full jar left. We have source on us right now. We don't. Let's just eat this last one. Sorry, Necromancer. is your mind. For just a moment, you feel your... When you open your eyes... Sorry, necromancers. Alright, that's another quest done. I guess the only ones we have left are escape. These two that are too high level for us and Sahela's people. But I don't think Sahel we can do Sahela's people yet. Because I think it's I think it's like farther away. Let's go. Go right here. We're doing it. We're doing things and stuffs. It only took like six streams, but we finally got off Fort Joy. Hey, my lady. I'm gonna save right here really quick. That's crazy. We didn't even need to change his persuasion. We just needed to be beast. Exactly, it happened eventually. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, 
Mysterio, who's she referring to? Boat first, questions later. Okay, board the Melody boat. Melody grabs the vessel with two hands and pushes it into the water. She hops on board behind you. God woken. Wait till she finds out. Salty water mists your face. Your skin prickles in bright, warm sunlight. The boat bobs forward through the water, and Fort Joy shrinks behind you. Yay! Ooh. Tired but victorious, the party made for the Lady Vengeance. The horrors of Fort Joy behind them. They arrived as sorcerers. They left as Godwoken. The fate of this godforsaken world now rested on their shoulders. Or at least on the shoulders of one of them. Yay, we finished the first the first part. Only like five or six more to go. Quirkus, you have something. A light sea breeze kisses your cheek and carries away the smell of blood wafting up from the deck. In the distance, Fort Joy looms. Made that a for for at last. I can't wonder uh, if all those people died uh, needed to die though. Uh, let this be a lesson to Alexander and his cronies. We will not be held. Yes. What were they thinking, standing against an eternal? I almost pity the poor ignorant beasts. Bad luck to let the dead linger aboard. As soon as we get moving, we ought to clear the deck. A hard-fought freedom, sure. But if spilling blood is bad, it shouldn't be so agreeable. Onward now. The sooner Fort Joy disappears from the horizon, the better. Hm. Perhaps the Seekers need help manning the ship. Darkmar has taken Fane's mask of the shapeshifter from Fane and face Oh, wait. Oh, it's because they left party. Okay. Well, well, this is a fine sight. Utterly barbaric, of course, destroying a tree and turning it into a boat. Grotesque, but, well, look at it, Quercus. A floating nest, surrounded on all sides by salt water, pure poison to a tree's root. The great acorn could never reach us out here. Well, yes, of course we'll continue our research, Quercus. We're not monsters. Still, I must admit, you were right about the shield. It proved to be more than adequate. Bow to the squirrel. No. Oh. <clears throat> yes, it, uh, it seems our shield is still here, Quercus. How does something so large and ungainly sneak up on a person? <laughs> <laughs> you give the giants too much credit, Quercus. I think the salty air has addled your mind. It has certainly been useful, but... Elegant, kind, surprisingly attractive. No, no, we have no time for your fawning. We may be safe, but the world is not. Come, we must return to our research. Confirm skeleton cat has a crush on us. Okay, so all, yeah, and all the DLC uh, sellers have moved onto the boat, it looks like. At least this one has. I don't know, I guess we'll find the other ones in a second. We keep moving around. Yeah, there who's that Mave? The Mave. Don't go any further, uh. Godwoken. We need you alive. Yeah, what's going on? The ship won't sail. We had orders to search every corner of it and figure out what's blocking us. Mm. It's hewn from Elven Livewood. I thought I could communicate with it, but... She glances over towards a smoldering pile of ash on the deck nearby. Something is nestled within it. Fragments of scorched bone. That was Brendan. When the ship wouldn't answer my call, he touched the figurehead, and it attacked him, without warning. He burned, like he was made of parchment. Yeah, we'll be careful. Just remember what I said, Godwoken. If you die, then this was all for nothing. Yeah, ask if she's learned anything useful before um, for the figurehead attack. Nothing. The ship is live wood. That much is clear. But I couldn't communicate with it. The Magisters must have done something, warped it somehow. I just don't know what. Yeah, express our condolences. Her eyes flick over to the smoldering ashes once again, her head held at a despondent angle. 
Thank you. We were held captive together on this ship. He kept my spirits up. Now he's dead. Okay. Well, actually, really quick log. Yes, we still have still hateless people, and we still have these two. <clears throat> lady Vor, speak to my lady. Okay, so that's the next quest. We just gotta speak to my lady. Save. I'm gonna touch it. Should I touch it? That's a pretty cool figurehead, though. Look at that. That's pretty cool. It's a dragon. Okay, we won't touch it. We won't touch it. No touchy touchy. Or we go de deady deady. Ooh. Ooh. Who's Kerbin? I don't know who Kerbin is, but he has some cool shit on him. Oh my goodness. Kerbin has some, some cool stuff. Ooh. Very cool stuff. Dagger? Oh my goodness. We have things for people, but they're not with us. We've seen the Void Touch Summoner mod. We haven't found anyone else yet. I think they're probably below deck. Mine, all of mine. All of this is mine. Tarlene. Hey, stranger. Glad to see you. No reds in the offing yet. Don't imagine they'll stay gone, though. Okay, good to know, Tarlene. Bye, Tarlene. Spare me, oh. Gareth. We got what we came for. This is what success looks like. I didn't go over near her. I won't see them tossed overboard. Not here. We'll hold a proper service. What's his face and so and so would want us to get this ship sailing before all else? They died for those Godwoken, after all. You know their names, Malady. Can't you even pay them that much respect? Gareth inhales sharply, then catches you out of the corner of his eye and smiles, barely. Our guest stirs. Welcome, Godwoken. Glad to see you safely aboard. Ah, uh, very glad indeed. The number of bodies li <laughs> littering the deck and how many they were lost in the battle. Too many. Yeah. One too few, actually. Alexander. He's alive. How the fuck is he alive? He died to plague, dude. I I killed him with plague. Apparently, you didn't hit hard enough. He's in the hold below decks. Unconscious, but alive. Yeah, Garrett better get a move on before the order arises. He's still large. Yes, we certainly had better. Yeah. The ship won't move. She's mute. We need to free her tongue. Yeah, I want to take a crack try, at it. Though I doubt it'll help. What Gareth means to say is don't bother. Livewood will only move when it wants to, or in this tub's case, when it's forced to. That's right. The ship's made of an elven ancestor tree, the spirit of which is still trapped in every plank. What we need is a way to control the bloody thing. Yeah, do they have any leads? The Seekers, the survivors of us, have been combing the ship from bow to rudder. It hasn't been easy. This place is laced with dark magic. These Seekers have such a limited skill set. We lost a man in the search. Malady might not appreciate that, but I do. And I hope you do too. Of course. I'm sure the Godwoken will be able to get the ship moving. They kind of like to feel useful, don't they? Uh, yeah, no, we'll, we'll, look, we'll look around. It's your best that'll save us all. <sighs> We'll do our best. Anyways, let's go back to doing what we were doing. Let's do this guy for his 20 gold. Who are you? Oh, it's Simone. Oh, there's the trickster. No, that's the, that's the jutsu guy. But does it have more? Oh my god, it has more. There's more of the same ones. Yeah, I'm not fucking with that. We already got these. It'd be uh, abusive if we went and sold and took them and sold them. Onyx headpats. Is on it. Being a dick earlier. Okay, Casey. I'll I'll get on it. Oh, he's right behind me. Hello, on it. Oh, he's like, oh god, no. Give me a second. I'll grab him.
Onyx. Let me love you. There you go. Here's Onyx. Onyx had pets. Onyx. Oi, Onyx. Being a dick. He's okay. There must be something around here. Oi, Onyx. Went down. Hmm. Okay. Freedom. There. I gave him quick head pats because he really wanted down. I couldn't hold him properly. I'll feed you in a bit after I'm done streaming, Onyx. I'll be done streaming in a second. I just want to see what else is on the top of this boat. The Red Prince is here. Look who we have here. The slave, no less. I wouldn't have bet tuppence on your survival. Yet here you are. Hello, Red Prince. It is quite a tale, I assure you. And the upshot of it all is that I've accomplished a goal on this horrid isle that came quite unforeseen. You're intrigued. Yes, I am. But of course. First, you must know that I'm a prince. The Red Prince. I'll give you a moment to let that sink in. You have no doubt heard the tales of certain setbacks that befell me. Setbacks that forced me to leave the ancient empire. My empire. It was then, forced as I was to wander the wilds, that a voice first began to reach me in my dreams. But the voice spoke from too great a distance, too faintly to be understood. Yet I had to understand. Somehow I knew this to be of vital importance. Okay. I searched this island for a dreamer, one of the mystics of our kind, who, as you undoubtedly know, can travel the dream world at will, as if it were another realm just as real as our own. And so I met with Bahara in the sanctuary of Amadia. We raced through dream wastes, beset by nightmares, until we reached the voice. Okay. It turns out it was that of Brahmos the Wanderer, the greatest and most elusive dreamer of them all. He desires that I should meet him somewhere on Reaper's coast, and meet him I shall. That is where my journey takes me next. Good job. Well, I wish you the best of luck. We already have a group of four. They're just not with us right now. Hello, Simone. You made it, God Woken. Good. Not all of us did, though. The sooner we leave this island behind us, the better. Okay. What else is on the top of this boat? That's where we go under. I think that's it. I think we've talked to everyone. Ow, it burned me. Ow, water. Water. Standing in water does nothing. I'm burning. Oh, there's another person that died. <laughs> Aw. Oh, I forgot we leveled up. Let's level up really quick. Um, Let's go put it into memory and con. And then let's put this into era third. No. Don't worry, there's a mirror down here. We'll be able to change it. I want to put it into summoning. That's what I wanted to do. 